To predict the path of any train, we just need to look at the shape of the railway line. In a similar manner, to predict the direction of force due to electric field, we introduce the concept of electric field lines. But while two railway lines can intersect each other, two electric field lines cannot. Let us study about such properties of electric field lines. 1. On the electric field line, the tangent drawn at any point indicates the direction of the electric field at that particular point. 2. Two electric field lines never intersect each other. If two lines intersect at a point, two tangents can be drawn at the same point, indicating two directions of an electric field at that point. This is not possible. Hence, two field lines can never cross each other. 3. The distribution of the electric field lines in a region of an electric field gives the intensity of electric field in that region. Let us clarify the point further. Suppose we want to draw field lines in an electric field due to a point charge Q. In practice, an arbitrary number of lines can be drawn. Let this number be n. If the lines are drawn by taking charge Q at the center of a sphere of radius R, the number of electric field lines perpendicular to the surface of the sphere will be equal to n. Therefore, the number of electric field lines passing perpendicularly through a unit surface area of the sphere is n upon 4 pi r square. This number is directly proportional to the intensity of the electric field at a distance r from the point Q. Therefore, n upon 4 pi r square is directly proportional to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon 0 into Q by r square or n is equal to beta into Q by epsilon 0 where beta is the proportionality constant. n is an arbitrary number assigned initially, hence the value of beta can also be determined. The electric field lines are used for geometrical representation of electric fields and are imaginary. The electric field is a reality. Four. Field lines of a uniform electric field are mutually parallel and equidistant. 5. Electric field lines of stationary electric charge distribution do not form closed loops. Let's summarize. Here we discussed important properties of electric field lines. We will go through them once again. The tangent drawn at any point on the electric field line gives the direction of the electric field at that point. Two electric field lines never intersect each other. The distribution of the electric field lines in a region of an electric field indicates its intensity. Field lines of a uniform electric field are mutually parallel and equidistant. Electric field lines of stationary electric charges do not form closed loops. We now know about the properties of electric field lines. Do you know when two equal and opposite point charges are kept at a certain distance? It gives rise to an interesting field pattern. Keep watching to find out more. Keep imbibing. We believe in you.